Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Back for We're some more Danganronpa. Back. We haven't moved an inch for about 20 minutes, but that's fine. I, I had to shit and and uh, Gassy had to be, uh, use the bathroom. I forgot what she had to do. I was yapping. Yapping oh, my were, trap. You were yapping in the bathroom? No. I went pee and then I, and then I came out. <laughs> And I started talking. Are you sure you were talking to the toilet? Don't worry what my ass was talking to. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Go, go ahead. There are a bunch of street booths filled with electric appliances at the back of a narrow alleyway. Why are you saying it like that? Are you paying attention? Because I almost oh. said electric and I was like, that's not right. Don't do it. <laughs> And then they take you higher. <laughs> Machines and other parts are cluttered together on display. It definitely seems fishy. It smells fishy too. Ugh. Ugh. But wait, there's more. With this many machines, we can probably find something we can use for two way communication, right? Sure, bud. It looks like it's best if I search around here. Okay. Oh, is that not? No, there it is. I may struggle to hit buttons because I'm wrapping my arm. My wrist is bugging me. Oh, I was like, why are you wrapping your arm? Because my wrist is bugging me? Yes, but I didn't know until you said it, and I was about yeah. to say... Why? Anyway, various anyway. desktop and laptop computers are arranged in a disorderly manner, like a pile of oversized trash. Yeah, hey, I could see me in there. <laughs> it's us! We're buds. <laughs> Though they're a little old fashioned and run down, they all look like they can still be used. I know. If we can connect to the internet, we might be able to call for help with these. As soon as I thought of that, I grabbed a random laptop, pulled it out of the pile, and turned it on. How to be turning something on, huh? For the first time in my life, <laughs> I tried to see if it would connect to the internet. And did it? Did it even turn on? Because uh, it looks, it's no use. Looks like it's not connecting. Well, there's no way it'd be that easy. But just when I was about to give up, my eyes noticed the strange icons arranged on the desktop. Ooh, Usami X File. The X Files? Oh. Usami X File, what is this? Your mother. Without thinking, I clicked that strangely named icon. It's a document file. Based on the format, it looks like it's some kind of report. God, Hajime using critical thinking skills? Impossible. I scanned it across the words displayed on the screen. About the biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history. <laughs> <laughs> this horrendous event originated with some students of Hope Speak Academy causing a revolt. The students of the res reserve department were dissatisfied with being treated differently than the primary department and began to fight the academy. Just Fists fight the academy's walls. <laughs> At first, the dispute was confined to the campus and hopes were high that it would settle down someday. But things quickly escalated. Behind the scenes of that rebellion, a huge authority was exerting its influence. Eventually it spread like an infection, provoking riots in various parts of the world. It was unlike any previous act of terrorism or coup d'etat. Close enough. <laughs> it seemed to have a much different purpose. 
However, no matter what we assume, we simply cannot apply reason to the subversive movement. Nonetheless, the destruction is not chaotic or disorganized. It is both purposeful and malicious. Therefore, just looks different. It just looks weird. Yeah, it, it, it is. The dash weird. is so bulky. Yeah. It is a subverse movement full of despair. Uh, Hope Speak Academy became the origin of the store incident and was forced to put an end to the er, long history. As f er, the students who survived <laughs> <laughs> did. They w r f r s t u k o e t o r as a lesson in despair. X. <laughs> is it Mega Man? <laughs> it is. It's no <laughs> use. The words are too garbled to read beyond this point. But what's this? What is this? What's this? <sighs> How normal. It's not normal like a dog barking. It's such a normal reaction that it's actually quite novel. Hey, can't you react with more gusto? Don't you know how very, very important this scene is? Could it be? Were you the one who created this file? Why, my, my, what makes you think of that? B because, the case, it's obviously the only thing I could think of. <laughs> it is the case. The case. The biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history. Riots in various parts of the world. And Hope Speak Academy getting destroyed. It sounds like something stupid you'd make up. And, and? What's Hope Speak Academy's reserve department? I've never even heard of that before. Oh, really? That's weird. Of all people, you should definitely be the only one who knows about it. What? What do you mean? No, oh, I guess you forgot about it. Along with the memories of your school life, so it can't be helped. Um. While we're on the subject of stupid things, that file said something about students who survived. Is that... Is it referring to us? Then the rest of that file is... Uh, hold on a sec, you guys! Just... What the heck have you guys been talking about? It doesn't make any sense! Now, Boys. now, let the grown-ups talk. Yes, let the grown-ups talk, you fucking moron! <laughs> Movies with no images, music with no sound, novels with no words. These are things that truly do not make any sense. So you can't say something this simple does not make any sense. Who cares about that? Just answer me. Who are the students who survived? I wouldn't know an important story like that, because the only thing I'm good for is being cute. <laughs> Damn it, he ran away again. Hey, Hajime. Hey yourself. I mean, d don't worry. It's gonna be fine. I'm sure he's making all that up. That's it. That's definitely it. No, thank you. Not absorbing that information. Oh, hey, it's Chucky. There's a lot of electric appliances in this mess, including home appliances and acoustic equipment. Ooh, let's get a guitar. All of these look old. Do they even still work? No, they don't. That's the answer. They do not work. Um, somehow, it looks like she's fishing things out of the pile of electric appliances. Chiaki, what happened? Are you looking for something? Uh, yeah, I was wondering if there are any game consoles in here. Sometimes old hardware is treated like junk. 
Uh, so that's what you're doing, nerd. I already have a TV in my cottage, so it doesn't have to be a non-portable device. I'll settle for anything. If you do some, find something, let me know. I'll help you carry it back to your cottage. <laughs> yeah, no, I will. <laughs> yeah, no, you're not getting in there. <laughs> nope. But I don't want to play video games for a while. I'd rather not be reminded of the previous incident. Ah, uh, because of tw Twilly Murder Surgum Geese? What is that? Just completely <laughs> forgets already. <laughs> Grr, are you serious? Arg, are you shitting me? What happened? Uh, I thought you'd be much happy. I mean, you'd be happier about being surrounded by so much machinery. Arg, I don't say stupid things. I'm the ultimate mechanic, you know? Of course I'm happy when I'm sur surrounded by machines. Then why do you look so mad? Dude, try to understand how I'm feeling. I, I have this wanna. unexplainable, conflicting feeling about whether or not I should be happy. I can't understand that kind of feeling. But why? Why do you feel so conflicted? The boulder feels very conflicted. <laughs> the boulder does not want to fight a little girl. <laughs> There's all the this boulder <laughs> has changed his mind. <laughs> no longer has conflicted feelings about beating up a little girl. <laughs> There's <clears throat> There's all this machinery lined up here. Hot damn, I want to take them apart. I want to dismantle them and look inside. <laughs> That's how I usually think, right? I know now's not the time for me to do something like that, and that's why I feel so conflicted. I'm scared. Is wanting to dismantle normal? Hell Only the yeah! Patriarchy. <laughs> Who said that? <laughs> Hell yeah! It's like if you have the hots for a chick, and you want to take off her clothes, right? Right? You want to check out her bone structure, oh. right? Like her ribs or where parts of her bones stick out, right? What? dismantle the patriarchy. That's not normal. That's a pretty acrobatic sex fetish. Like, it actually is kind of interesting because he's not looking at the bits, he's looking at the bones. Seriously? That's what we call a serial killer. Mm. I see. So wanting to see a chick's bone structure makes me a little perverted. Pretty much. Not looking at her titties. Yeah, all right. That's that's fine. Whatever. I care. Oh my god. Uh, I think we were going this way. Yep. Mm -mm -mm. Busted. Oh, welcome! Great. We're currently showing right now, so please wait five minutes for the next showing to start. Showing? What does that mean? Are your eyes just for show? Look around, this is a movie theater, right? Yeah, how I'm you obviously mean I'm showing stupid. a movie! I'm sorry? Nothing. I said, yeah, Hajime, don't be fucking stupid. <laughs> Hajime's got tiny baby brain. We all know this. Baby brain! Showing a movie? Well, I guess there's no need to even ask. You're just gonna say this is the next motive, right? Just like Twilight Syndrome murder case? I'm definitely not gonna watch your movie. Whatever it is, I'm never gonna see it. My goodness, and I was thinking about giving you an invitation ticket. But I will not allow you to not watch it. I went to a lot of trouble to make this movie. If you don't watch it, I'm gonna be sad. Uh, I'm sure your movie is no different than that game you made. The game was a shorty piece of crap, but this movie's definitely a masterpiece. Anyway, as long as I refuse to allow it, you will never have the choice to not watch it. I am Monokuma. On this island, my word is law. 
If I don't watch it, what are you gonna do about it? There's no way I'd allow such reckless behavior. There's no way I'd allow it. But I'll forgive you if you purchase a Monokuma sticker at the goods counter over there. No. Monokuma sticker? You heard me. Uh, 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 okay. There's some strange goods on top of the counter. If you can call them goods. Look at him. This one. Looks like a tote bag made of hemp cloth with a decal of Monami's face on it. I would call them bads. <laughs> I hate myself. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Did that catch your eye? It's an all-purpose top bag, useful for a, vari a variety of common tasks. It's a limited item, only one person can have it. By the way, apparently tote bags were originally invented to carry around ice, did you know that one? So how about it, wanna buy it? Ugh, I'll pass. Yeah, I thought you say that. I'll just be up front with you. I caught a lot of corners making that thing. That's too up front. Is this the sticker you were talking about? <sighs> I'm I need to wear sorry I was born stupid. I need to wear that. <laughs> it's not funny, and I don't understand its purpose. How half acid is this? <laughs> Acid. <laughs> to tell you the truth, this is a very lucky sticker I received from a wandering medical working priest. What the fuck? But it could be yours for mm. the special price of only 1.5 million dollars. Mm, 1.5 million dollars? You heard me. Don't mess with me. I don't even have that kind of money. Well, you should make some money then. Then you can pay me back when you get off the, this island. If you don't like it, you can always just watch my... No. Fine, I'll pay it. Oh, I'm surprised. As long as I can pay it after I get out of here, I'll pay anything, even one and a half million dollars. <gasps> You're the first person to ever pay 1.5 million dollars for this sticker. In other words, you really don't want to watch my movie. Oh, that makes me a sad monokuma. But if I'm going to make a huge profit, it's okay. I'm a mascot with, who has a hobby of counting money after all. <laughs> You're the worst mascot ever. Come on, take it, thief. Slap it on your forehead, thief. Take advantage of this uh, divine opportunity, <laughs> thief. No. The sticker I received was even thinner and more cheap looking than I thought it would be. It's like a prize from a box of candy. Did I really agree to pay so much money for this piece of crap? Maybe I'm a little crazy. Oh there. Looks like the showing is over. Alrighty, I gotta collect those questionnaires. At that moment, Monokuma started humming and skipped away toward the door leading into the theater. <laughs> the door opened violently and one person appeared from within. Wait, is he saying that out loud? <sighs> yes. Ah, oh, Nagito, please answer my questionnaire. It doesn't matter if I answer it. That movie was so boring, it was torture. Minutes felt like weeks while I was watching it. <laughs> uh, um... Well, I guess that's what art is, because it's not really art unless it surpasses common sense. I thought it was going to be another motive, but I guess that's not a case. What a letdown. <laughs> if money would have settled this, I should have just settled it with money. N Nagito is so depressed. The movie must have been really, really bad. I definitely made the right call by not watching it. 
I'm uh, glad we avoided it. that because that's pretty. It's pretty brutal, yeah. Yeah. What the fuck? <sighs> I'm so tired from boredom. Money would have gotten me out. Of, gotten me out of seeing it. I should have just settled it with money. Let me ask you something. If you were told you could pay one and a half million dollars and not watch that movie, I'd gladly pay it. Shit. Quick answer. The movie must have been that bad, huh? Jesus. Is that it? Uh, um. Well, Hajime after Nagito's glowing <laughs> review, did you change your mind about watching my movie? Fuck no. I mean, of course not. <laughs> so. That's the, the next pro tag tune. Oh my goodness. We get to yes. be a girl? You get to be a girl. Yes. In Ultra Despair Girls. Old, more girls? Yes. T it, remember, I told you, it's Toko's game. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yep. Oh, I'm excited. I can't wait. I miss Genocide Jill. <laughs> you're, you're, you're gonna have a blast with her then. Hell yeah. It's a video game poster. Hmm, looks interesting. I'm definitely gonna buy that. <laughs> I'm definitely gonna <laughs> buy <awesome>. that game. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's just dip. Let's dip. I'm Jimmy, and over while here. Sonya's yelling at us, that's where we'll call it for this episode. Oh. Goodbye. Goodbye, everyone. Thank you for joining us. Join us next time on Dongon Rompa.